Hey everybody, Joy here. I'm in a big hurry this morning. Got home almost dark last night and then that man that bought the other RV wanted it immediately and oh, rough evening. But anyway, the other RV is gone now and I named our new one. The new RV, its real name is Ventana L.E. and I named her Tana Lee. Tana Lee, isn't that cute? Okay. No, Joy, that's dumb. Well, in my opinion, <laughs> totally. So today is September 22, 2021, and it is a Wednesday? I think it's Wednesday already. My goodness. The Heart of Jesus. Matthew 5, 3. Blessed are the poor in spirit. For theirs is the kingdom of heaven. I wonder what Jesus meant by poor in spirit. The world gives a great deal of recognition to powerful, strong, and wealthy people. But Jesus made it plain that none of those things are most important to God. Jesus gives honor to those who are poor in spirit. That doesn't mean financially poor people. It means those who are humble and who show kindness, respect, and honor to others. That's the kind of spirit that reflects the heart of Jesus. I like that, and that I can agree with that. Treat everyone with politeness, even those who are rude to you. Not because they are nice, but because you are. I like that. That was from Anonymous. <laughs> All right, my friends. I'm sorry about the days I missed. Let's just look at them real quick and see what they were called. A lot of you have the book and you can read them. September 21 was part of the process. Come follow me, Jesus said, and I will send you out to fish for people. That was Matthew 4:19. Oh boy, that's a good one. We are out to fish for people. The people might not like it, but that's what we're supposed to be doing. September 20 was the Holy Spirit, the Advocate, the Holy Spirit, whom the Father will send in my name, will teach you all things and will remind you of everything I have said to you. Oh, do you all have the Holy Spirit? Do you have the Holy Spirit? You know, if you ask, God for the Holy Spirit, He will send the Holy Spirit to you. The Holy Spirit can dwell within you. And the Bible says someplace, if a child asks a father for something, would the father deny him? And so the Bible says if you ask Jesus for the Holy Spirit, that you can have that. I love that, and I do have it, and so does Jerry. All right, the 19th. Did we do the 19th? Yeah, I think we did the 19th. So we missed the 20th and the 21st. And today is the 22nd. Blessed are the poor in spirit, which means the kind and loving and short-tempered. All right. So that's today's devotional, and I must run. Jerry and I have a trip planned to Missouri. And I think we're leaving, like, next Wednesday, <laughs> which is going to be a blink of an eye here. So, um... Lots and lots of things I've got to do to get prepared. I probably won't be sewing at all. You may remember that I'm making a bedspread quilt for Tana Lee. I have the backing pinned and rolled on. I have the top pinned and rolled on. And I have been waiting forever and ever for the batting that I need to arrive. I ordered it from Amazon. It's supposed to be here in two days. This is like 10 days. Still hasn't got here. So last week gotten here. Last week I ordered it again from a different place on Amazon and it's not supposed to be here till I don't even know when. So my new bedspread quilt won't be done for our trip to Missouri. But I'm using my mother's. Uh, my mother loved those white candle wicking kind of bedspreads. They have all those little bumps all over them, you know. And I had bought one for, for her. Uh, just before she died. She died 21 days after I bought it for her. 
So it's brand, brand spanking new. I had it cleaned and, and wrapped in plastic, and so I got it out of the closet the other day, and I'm using it. And it makes me perfectly happy to use her bedspread. Pardon my voice. I don't know, fall. I don't know what can be in the air in the fall, but anyway, it's something. All righty, my friends, going to let you go for now. I'll try to be back every day before we go on our vacation, okay? Love you. Be back soon.